Hi, and welcome to our second second grade reading lesson. Um, last week we talked about digraphs, and you will see a few digraphs, not very many, but a few in this lesson. So please go back and watch other videos um, or repeat activities if you need to review. Um, remember that and at a follow-up activity, so an activity to do after this lesson is over, um, is going to be in the folder on the Merrick Moore webpage. If you go to Merrick Moore, then click About Us, and then you scroll down, and on the left-hand side, you'll see Exceptional Children's Updates. You can click that. Um, and then you'll see my name, but then if you scroll down a little bit, you'll also see a tiger with my name on it. You want to click on the tiger that has my name on it, and that opens up all of my lessons and activities. So um, we are going to talk about blends today. Let me share my screen with you. Okay, wonderful. So quick review before we talk about blends. Digraphs are two consonants that come together to make one new sound. So CH says CH, SH says SH, TH says TH, and WH says WH. Blends are also two consonants or three consonants. Um, that come together, but they keep their individual sounds. We just blend those sounds together to make um, a beginning of a word or the end of a word, um, but it's multiple consonants. So we will see that's the definition again. Blends are two or three consonants that um, whose sounds blend together. I've listed some blends right here for us to look at. So guys, these are not words. These are just parts of words. So we're going to practice blending these sounds together really quickly. Just follow my arrow. Now you do it. Two consonant sounds together. Now this one. Now you do it. This one is k, er, kr, k, er, kr. Make the sound kr. K, l, cool. Mm hmm. See if you can do this one. G, er, gr. B bull, bull, bur, bur, tur, tur, st, st, fur, fur. Now, those were all two letter blends. Now we're getting into three letter blends. Sk, er, sk, er, skr. Stir, stir, spool, spool, spool. Say that. Spur, spur, spur. Yeah, these two have a digraph. These are our trickiest ones, and you're not going to see many of these. What's actually these two? If you see, th is a digraph and SH is a digraph. So we say that digraph sound with the other consonant. So TH says th, th, er, th, er, and SH says sh, sh, er, sure. So these are all blends. I encourage you um, to set up there a little bit at the end um, for people who don't want to go as slowly. But please, um, if you would like to, or parents, if you, um, would like your kid to have more practice with this, go ahead and pause this screen and just have your students run through all of um, the sounds and blending those sounds together. So you want to listen for, you don't want to be saying sk, you want to be saying sk. It's okay if you need to say sk, sound it out first and then blend it, but be sure it's one fluid sound, sk, okay? But for those who aren't pausing, we're going to go ahead. So. Um, this is an activity where we are going to see 
um, some different endings, some different rhymes. So you'll see these two words that have um, covered letters, the beginnings are covered, um, have the same ending sound, okay? So what does A, P, C? App, and down here, app. This word, this is an L. So who can sound out this word and read it? Lap, what's the word? Lap, okay. Now, listen to lap, it has three sounds. Lap, lap, right? But what would I put at the beginning if I changed the word from lap to clap? Clap, like I clap my hands, clap. What do you hear first now? Clap. Most of you will say you hear k. It is a C. But if I just had, remember my words, clap. If I just put k out, that's going to make the word cap, like a baseball cap. And I didn't say the word cap. I said the word clap. There is a blended sound that we still need that goes with this C to make it say clap. Lap, clap. Let's say it really slowly. Clap. What do you hear after the c clap? Clap. If you guessed another L, you're right. So our blend is cool. Clap. Okay. Maybe if you weren't. So now we have a different rhyme at the end. So, ib. Ib. The first word we're going to look at is this word. Who can sound it out first before I say it? Rib. Can you say that? Rib. Okay. So that spells rib. But how would I spell crib? Like the baby lies in a crib. Listen carefully. Crib. First sound you hear, crib. I heard a cuff first. Ib. It's not just kib, it's crib. Crib. What am I missing? Do you hear it? What am I missing? Crib. There's a blended sound. Cur. Cur, ib, crib. Now, does it spell crib? Yes, it does. You really have to pay attention to what you're hearing before we start spelling these words. See, this is really, really tricky. I know you guys can do it. So the next rhyme we're going to look at is ip. Ip. Okay? Ip. Ip. No. What would this word spell? Sound it out first. See if you can get it. Lip, pull it, lip. Now, pull it, lip. What would you say? Hold on one second. Miss Hardy forgot the next word. She needs to look. Okay, okay. Excuse me, I forgot the next word. I had to in and look. Okay, now I'm, I'm going to reshare with you. I can do it. Thanks for pausing with me. I made a mistake. I just didn't write down that next word. I couldn't remember what I put. Okay. So. Oh no. Well. What would we write if the next word was slip, slip? Be careful, don't slip on the ice, slip. What do you hear first in the word slip? A lot of you might have said S, Miss Hardy, 
But if I just left it like this, it would be sip. And my word wasn't sip. My word was slip. Slip. I'll slow down. Slip. Slip. What am I missing? L. So let's say this blend together. Soul. Soul. Bip. Slip. Now, the next uh, rhyme we're looking at is op. To the O. Op. Op. Who can tell me what this word is? Top. Top. Very good. Now, how would we change it in this next part to make it say stop? Stop. So that you guys can get it without me doing it. Listen very carefully. I'll say it slowly. See if you can figure out both sounds, the blend that goes here. Here's the top. This word's stop. 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 If you got ST, you were right. Now, oh, this is our finale. This is our last one. Um, and this, we're going to have three different words. They all end in am, 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 that rhyme. But we are going to do a word without a blend, a word with a two-letter blend, and a word with a three-letter blend, okay? And I know you guys can do this. Yeah. So the next word is this one. See if you can sound it out. Remember now, am, I didn't do anything with this because this isn't a lesson on glued sounds, but if you remember, am doesn't say am, it's a glued sound. That M changes the sound of that A a little bit. Just remember, am says am. Okay, so go ahead and see if you can sound out that word. Ram, ram. Go ahead and say that, ram. Now, the next word we are going to spell, we already have our rhyme here at the end, is cram, cram. I'm gonna say it slowly. Cram. It's the first sound you hear in cram. Cram. There's an R there too. Cram. Cram. So what is this word? Ram. What is this word? Cram. So the last word is gonna have a three-letter blend, and that word is going to be Scram. Try to say it out loud. Scram. Scram. What is the first sound you hear in scram? Say it very slowly so you can hear all the sounds, and I'll say it slowly too. Scram. Scram. It's kind of hard to hear it, but s r am scream. So let's see if we can read each word. Ram, cram, scram. So really, hard. we're gonna keep working on these now. Oh, you guys are doing such a great job. I just know it. I miss being able to do that this with you guys in person. Um, but I know you guys are working so hard at home. I miss you. Um, so here is a list of words that all have blends in it. Um, I'm going to give you a minute if you need longer. Please just pause the screen when I start um, talking again. But I'm going to give you a few seconds to kind of look at these and see if you can um, find a blend in each word. Remember, a blend is two or three consonants that go together um, or that are blended together at the beginning or end of a word. Go ahead.
So I'm going to start back again. If you need longer, that's okay. This is the time to go ahead and pause your screen. Okay. So I am going to show you all of the blends. Looky there. Did you find them all? Notice I didn't highlight these because these are digraphs, not blends, because these make their own brand new sound. They don't keep their um, individual sounds like blends do. I, here's another opportunity to pause. I would like you to go through um, and try to read them all. I am also going to go through and read them all. So if you want the practice, Oh, look, I must already missed one. That L needs to be highlighted. This needs this BL, this blend here, not just the B. Um, if you want to go ahead and pause your screen and try to read them by yourself, and then you can um, listen to me read them. But I'm gonna, about to go ahead and read them. So if you want to read them by yourself, that's great. Go ahead and pause your screen. Okay. So this first word, my blend is sl, slam, slam, trip, trip. Oh, remember this is a blend. Miss Hardy just forgot to highlight this one. Bled, bled, glad, glad, slug, slug. Smog, smog, bread, bread, crop, crop, spat, spat, glob, glob, sw, sw, am, swam. Plug, plug, clap, clap, splash, splash, crash, crash, stop, stop, drag, drag, drip, drip. Is a diagraph in a blend here. This is, this is a tricky type. Sure, shrug, shrug, as SH says. Shh. Crab, crab, strum, strum. Okay, last thing, guys, before you can go ahead and go on to your activity. Remember, you can always come back and watch the videos again or parts of it um, if you feel like you need to or want to practice. So it says, let's read, let's read these sentences. These sentences have some blends in them. So again, I'm going to give you a second. If you need longer, when I start back talking, you can pause your screen. But see if you can locate the blends in these sentences. I'll go ahead and tell you there are. There are seven blends, seven blends. See if you can find them all. If you need more time, go ahead and pause. Okay, here are the blends. Did you find all of them? Go ahead and check yourself. Now we're gonna read these. Um, now, we're gonna take our time, especially with the words that have blends in them. We're gonna read them a couple times. Um, first, to just get the words right. And the second time, to read it a little bit faster. And then the third time to really understand what we're reading. So let's sound out this word together. Fur, 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 ogs, frogs, here's a sight word, like, to, 
swan, down, swim. Frogs like to swim. Let's do the next one. What's the sight word? The mm -hmm. glass. Glass. Sight word has a spot. Spot on it. The glass has a spot on it. Good. This one says, Brad, Brad, must be a name. Brad is gl glad. Remember, is is a sight word. Brad is glad, some more sight words, to see his when Brad is glad to see his twin. Now let's go back that third time. I read each sentence twice, one by one, but now let's see if we can read it all. Try to read it with me. Um, and then I'm gonna go through it one more time, pointing after we read it together. Um, for you to read it by yourself. Frogs like to swim. The glass has a spot on it. Brad is glad to see his twin. Now you go ahead and read it. Okay, well, guys, that was all for the day. Remember, you can go on and do the activities. Um, I am so glad that you watched this video, and I cannot wait um, to do another reading lesson next week. See you soon.